So the 5 volts comes out of your charger, comes through here, and instead of going directly into your mega boom, we've spliced the wire here so that it's split, spliced through either wire, positive or negative, and then it comes through and it goes into your current of your multimeter. Charging, please wait. 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 So we completely Charging. give up waiting please for wait. it to charge. We do a software update. That didn't help. If yours shows a 40% charge, it maybe had the same problem. 40% charge. Here's another faulty unit. Let's begin by taking the battery out and changing it. Be careful when you open the unit. See my 12 tips on taking it apart. I strongly advise taking these rings off. Remove the battery. Insert a brand new battery. This is the current measuring setup I showed. We current test the charging of a new battery. The low reading indicates there's no charge going into it. So maybe the battery I just replaced was okay. Here I test a working grey UE Mega Boom. Charge is going in. We unplug the power adapter, put it into the non-charging one, and the charge is the same as before, zero. YouTube says stick it in the freezer, so after 1 hour and 10 in the freezer, we get one nice and cold UE Mega Boom. A cold, non-charging UE Mega Boom. So let's swap the charge boards and see what happens. Something to do if you're bored. We put the working grey one into the blue one. Yeah, so we swapped the board over. Well, it looks like it now works. 40% charge. 40% charge, and then let's see if it charges. It's charging with the new board from the grey one. So here we see a pink one that actually works. Fully charged. Once it's fully charged, the LED stops flashing. At full charge, the current actually drops. When turning it on and off, the current shoots up. If you have a faulty charge board, this doesn't happen. The faulty charge board does not allow current to the unit. If tests show no current input, the board may be faulty. Find a donor board or buy a new unit. Thanks for watching.